Well, Memorial Day weekend is one of the busiest weekends for tourism here at Myrtle Beach. In anticipation of what could be record numbers of visitors, the city manager is implementing some temporary rules. WMBF's Eric Richards has a look at how people are reacting to that recently signed executive order. Golf carts and mopeds are an easy way to get around Myrtle Beach, especially during the holiday season. But an annual executive order restricting their use along Ocean Boulevard could have some hitting the brakes. From a driver's point of view, it can be kind of aggravating. The city of Myrtle Beach continues to prepare for Memorial Day weekend with an executive order restricting golf carts and mopeds on Ocean Boulevard. Starting Friday, May 26, just after midnight, until Monday, May 29th, golf carts will be prohibited between 29th Avenue North the entire weekend. These Myrtle Beach residents do not agree. That's why we have it, to ride down here and enjoy the enjoy the beach. During the same time frame, mopeds will be prohibited on ocean from 8 at night to 8 in the morning. I mean, I feel like if they're going to put a restriction on one open air motor vehicle, it should include all open air motor, motor vehicles. Right. right now, there's very little traffic along Ocean Boulevard. That's because basically it's not the holiday or the summer season just yet. But city leaders say they want to restrict or have to restrict golf carts and mopeds along the boulevard here in order to keep traffic moving in case of an emergency. The Ocean Boulevard again will be one way southbound from 29th Avenue North all the way down to the south city limits. Golf carts and mopeds tend to travel below the speed limit, which is why this man agrees with the order. You're trying to try never navigate the crowd. Yeah. Now you're trying to navigate around old street. The executive order also grants police chief Amy Prock the authorization to call in additional resources if needed. That could be from the federal, state, or local government levels. It also allows the chief to establish no cruising zones citywide. In Myrtle Beach, Eric Richards, WMBF News.